remember the Pixelmon NFT project that launched about two years ago and raised $70 million. And then this is what the NFT release looked like. Bruh. I don't even know what that's supposed to be. Absolutely horrifying. And so even though some people paid three ETH just to mint them at the time, which was over $10,000 worth for one NFT, you can see that after the launch happened and the reveal of these NFTs, the floor price absolutely tanked. But what happened over the next two years is a story that's still running itself and it's a good one. Pixelmon, with its $70 million of funds raised, got new leadership and turned everything around. Pixelmon now has a new face with new branding, new leadership, new strategic partners, investors, and a whole new look. We can see that near the bottom in the summer of 2022, after the massive fall off in price from the reveal, the Pixelmon NFTs bottomed around 0.2 ETH, but have now gotten back up to around 1.6 ETH floor. And you can see that the art is significantly better. They've changed it, they've revamped the whole thing. And today we're gonna to talk about the Mon token coming out this month and how this new team changed everything and has a hugely bright outlook for 2024. So this is the new team and the new strategic partners and investors that are backing Pixelmon and the Mon protocol. You can see people from Animoca Brands, Nine Gag, Immutable, Crunchyroll, and a bunch others. And some investors that you may also have heard of, some venture funds that you may have heard of, and maybe even more importantly, some influencers and Web3 natives that definitely know about the gaming space. People like Alex Becker, FaZe Banks, Zeneca, Elio Trades, and a bunch others are all key opinion leaders and strategic angel investors in Pixelmon and the Mon protocol, which is going to be the token that powers the governance, the IP, and the ecosystem behind Pixelmon. And not only will it power Pixelmon the game, but it will power four games that they're launching this year in 2024. Two of them being mid-core and two of them hyper-casual games. And we'll talk about those games a little bit later in the video. So let's look at this Mon token and it is coming out this month in February. So if you're watching this video, definitely pay attention because you wanna know how to get in on this. And I'll show you that just in a second. The Mon token tokenomics, you can see that 6% of them are gonna be the community presale, which we'll talk about in just a second. 30% of them is gonna be the community claim, which we'll also talk about just in a second. Both of those you can get access to in this video. I'll show you how to do that. The ecosystem fund, which is gonna be basically just powering the ecosystem behind the games they're creating is 29%. The team will take 15%. 2% for launch contributions, 5% for liquidity, for trading, and then 13% for the strategic round of investors, which we showed you some of those people before. Now, if you care about the token unlocks and the vesting and how all that works, you can see here, they've done a pretty good job laying it out. And it is good to know that they're gonna have it vesting over the course of a minimum of 24 months for a lot of these and a maximum of 48 months for some of these things. So the next two to four years, there will be coins constantly hitting the market, keeping this ecosystem fueled and powering forward. Okay, the first thing you really need to care about on how to get in on the Mon token, which is dropping again sometime this this month is the Mon Missions. If you click on the link down below, you can go over to this mission page and all you have to do is connect your Twitter account. That's it, this is totally free to do. And if you use my referral code, you'll get an extra 200 points right off the bat when you first sign in. You can see I currently have 10 referrals and hopefully you'll make the 11th or maybe even 12th if there's two of you that go ahead and refer me because when you refer me, I'll get 200 points and so will you. And so everyone's winning there. These missions here are completely free to do. All you need to do is have your Twitter and your Ethereum wallet that you wanna use. The first one here is you'll go ahead and add the dragon emoji with the dollar sign Mon to kind of get the word out on your Twitter username. That's 2000 points. The next one for 1000 points is to link your wallet. And then you see there's a bunch of other ones which is just following the Mon protocol on Twitter, following Pixelmon and following some of the CEOs and leaders of the Pixelmon team. Then you can also go and like and re retweet one of the tweets to help get the word out. And by doing all those, you're gonna get over 10,000 points already. So that's quite a bit, easy to do, free to do, recommended highly. Then what you'll see here is every day you can go over and do a daily spin. 
every 24 hours you can do a daily spin. You can win anywhere from 25 up to 3,000 points every single day by spinning the wheel. And then after you're done that, you're gonna get your own referral code on this page where you can go and send that to your friends and when they sign up, they'll get 200 points extra and so will you. Again, all this is free and what these mission points are going to do is gonna allow you to get some Mon tokens when the token generation event happens. So this is the only free way to get in on the Mon launch and I highly recommend doing it. I'm not sure how many points will equate to the Mon tokens themselves, but we can guarantee that by doing this, you'll get at least some allocation, even if it's small. And if you don't think it's worth your time, think again, because what I told you guys a couple videos ago is to go and download Heroes of Mavia, which is a new Web3 game that's coming out, and it actually did just come out. If you did that, all you had to do was download the game and you would have gotten 12.5 Mavia tokens. Now that doesn't sound like a lot, but if we go over and look at the Heroes of Mavia token which launched one week ago at about two dollars and sixty cents in one week it's up 4x to eight dollars now like i said if you downloaded the game all you had to do was download the free game you would have gotten 12.5 mavia tokens right when the game came out that's currently worth almost a hundred dollars a hundred dollars for free just to download the game and try it out that's pretty freaking good now i'm not saying that the mon token will do a 4x in the first week i have no idea what the mon token will do but i would say that the game of heroes of mavia is on par with Pixelmon and their notoriety in the space. I would even say that Pixelmon's more notable and has more fundraising than Mavia has because Mavia is just one game and Pixelmon aims to do several games this year. So Pixelmon and the Mon token could very well be worth getting into, especially if it's for free and it's pretty easy to do. So even though that is one free way to get in on the Mon token, there's also going to be a Mon token pre-sale happening very soon. And that's another way to guarantee yourself some Mon tokens right when the token generation event happens. If you go over to the pre-sale page here, you can see pretty much how it works. If you own a Pixelmon NFT, you can see based on the rarity of your Pixelmon NFT, you'll be able to get a certain number of lots. And what is a lot, you might ask? Well, a lot is basically just the amount of pre-sale tokens you can purchase. Currently, they are estimating that a lot will cost about $250 in Ethereum, and that number will be announced exactly two hours before the presale happens. But for example, if you had a common Pixelmon NFT, you could buy one lot or about $250 US worth of Mon tokens in the presale. If you had a mythical one, you can get 15 lots or about $3,000 worth of Mon tokens in the presale. But to get one of these NFTs, if you don't have one currently, you'd have to go over and buy a floor NFT or whichever one you want for a minimum of 1.6 ETH, which is several thousand dollars. So that's, you know, kind of expensive if you want to get in on the presale. The only other way to get in on the presale would be to get a waitlist spot. And as of now, if you don't have a Pixelmon NFT or if you don't have a golden trainer, you will not be able to get in on the presale unless you have a waitlist code. You can see right here, there's going to be a raffle for waitlists. And the only way to get a waitlist code is to get one from someone who is in the Pixelmon universe already or owns a Pixelmon NFT. Now, luckily for you, I actually was able to get two waitlist codes for this video. One of them I'm gonna give away in the comments down below, and since not many people watch my videos at the moment, you have a pretty good chance to win that one down below. But if you don't get that one, the other way to get it is to join my private membership group, which is mattscrypto.com. Join it down below. We do a bunch of different alpha, NFT, whitelist giveaways. I have a whole airdrop farming guide going on right now. So if you wanna join that group, the other one of the waitlist codes will be given away in the private membership down below. Quickly going over to the FAQ, you can see that there's gonna be a snapshot six hours before the presale happens. And that's when they'll know who has a Pixelmon NFT and who will be getting access to those lots to purchase Mon tokens in the presale. You can see here that we have Monday, Feb 2024. Since we're halfway through the month already, we know that it's gonna be either this upcoming Monday or the following Monday. That's it, it's happening very soon. So if you're watching this video and you wanna participate, make sure you get one of those waitlist codes and then do all of the potential missions that you have available to yourself, do your daily spin to get the maximum amount of mission points and therefore the maximum allocation for Mon tokens when that happens. Now for the waitlist raffle and the two waitlist codes I'll be giving away in this video, that's gonna happen after the presale window closes. So the winner's gonna be drawn at random, it is a true raffle, 
but you will be able to get that after the presale actually happens. So keep that in mind. So the Mon token is a big deal because it will power the Pixelmon game and ecosystem, but it's also going to power other games that Pixelmon and the team are coming out with this year. One of those games is called Pixel Pals. And this one is one that they're gonna be giving away $120,000 US dollars in Mon token in this game in season one. If we head over to the Pixel Pals Twitter, we can see that season zero is gonna be launching Q1 of 2024. Now, since we're halfway through February, that's gonna be in the next month and a half. So not only is the presale happening this month, but the game Pixel Pals, where you can win $120,000 in prizes, is launching this quarter as well. A lot's happening for Pixelmon right now, which is why if you're watching this video, do not hesitate, go to the links down below, get your mission points, check out the game, and start playing so you can participate in what potentially could be a really valuable coin over the bull run in the next two years. Now for the Pixel Pals game, you can see right here, it's a pretty simple game. They call it a hyper casual game. It's a blend of pet management, land management, and a card dueling game. This sounds like my kind of game. I like mobile games, I like simple games, card games. It's pretty simple strategy. It's easy to tell what's going on and it's cute as hell. I will definitely be checking this game out and hopefully be able to farm some Mon tokens in this game in addition to the missions that we're doing and in addition to the pre-sale that I'm hopefully gonna participate in if I get the chance to. There you have it. Click the link down below. Use my referral code at Matt Cabuzio to get 200 extra points for your Mon missions. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like and go ahead and watch this video because if you like the video you just watched, you're gonna love this video as well.